What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at what's coming Monday. So we know that we get boosters and epics new every Monday and we did have the Bayern Munich pack. We were lucky enough to get Philip Lamb. We did actually spin for him. We got him in three 10 pack spins, so 30 spins in total. I have reviews and gameplay and loads of stuff up on the channel about Philip Lamb. But what's coming Monday? Well, we are going to be getting a new Italian midfielder selection it looks to be a pretty weak selection, lads. Let's be honest. Labotka is probably the pick of the pack in here, but you're never really spinning for these cards. I mean, these cards are not the draw and never are the draw. It's always going to be the legends and the epics. But you can see here the 29th of April, which is the coming Monday, and that always gives a clue as to what legends are coming and what are in the database, right? So we're going to just take a quick look here at Labotka. We're going to take a look at what his potential stats could be, but it's going to be all about the legends, and they do give a good kind of indicator as to what's going to be coming. Again with Labaka, a lot of people talk about Labaka, a lot of people kind of like, like using him, especially the older card. I think it's a really good card, but as I said, you're not going to be spinning for these, unless it's an extraordinary player in the selection, such as, you know, maybe there has been a couple like Saliba with the, uh, the English pack a couple of weeks ago, the English Guardians. Saliba is like 102 overall centre back. These guys as the three top picks are not really going to be uh, <laughs> worth spinning for, in my personal opinion. Of course, if you're in the pursuit of epics and you get them, you can throw them in and you can have a bit of crack with them, but they're not going to be able to compete with the epics. So speaking of the epics, let's get straight into it. It looks like we are going to be getting a brand new legend added, which is Albertini. This is him at 31 levels. We don't know what levels he's going to have or his finalized levels are going to be. We'll have a look at his card there in a second. It's an interesting card. I think it's going to be like a deep kind of sitting um, DMF type player like Pirlo. You also have Nedved who's down as a whole player. We'll get a look at his profile there as well in a second. I think Nedved is probably going to be the kind of hidden gem of this, even though it's, you know, he's obviously going to be a beast. But Davids is going to be the one that most people go for. I think that Makaleli and Davids are the same as right card versus Vieira. That Makaleli versus Davids versus Kante is like that right card versus um, Vieira battle for DMFs or CMFs or chasing DMFs is what I call them, destroyers. So we are going to take a look at some of the stat lines here and some of what potentially could make this card up, which is a 31 level Albertini. No manager booster, no booster here because it's not obviously confirmed yet or finalized yet, but he's going to be, be about probably a 97, 98 DMF with the boosters. And if you are playing with Guardiola or Javi Alonso, he's down as an orchestrator. So again, kind of like a Pirlo-esque. Davids is going to be like Makalele. If you have Makalele or you've got a big time booster card similar to Davids, I know some people are using Roberto Carlos in DMF. It's a similar kind of role. Massive stamina, massive speed, chasing every ball that you possibly can. And obviously have high aggression, tackling and defensive engagement as well from the rip. Davids is down as a destroyer, more of a defensive kind of disruptor. That Nedved is going to be a whole player. Now, this is a very interesting card because Nedved can actually finish. You can have like 80 finishing, 80 tight possession, 85 low pass and dribbling, 85 acceleration and speed, 90 balance. It's a very, very nice card. I definitely think a lot of people would be interested in Nedved. But let me know what you guys think. We will be back streaming on Monday as we always do. I'll talk to you then.